over against the water shelf for the rings, too, for the places of the falls to bear the table. And thou shalt make the falls of the fish more than overlay them with gold, and they shall be for carrying the table, and thou shalt make its dishes, and its spoons, and its jars, and its bowls, to use for pouring out of pure gold, shalt thou make them, and thou for shalt set upon the table showbread before me always, and thou shalt make a candlestick of pure gold, the reason where shall the candlestick be made, its shaft of branches, its walls, and its bulbs, and its flowers shall be of the same, and six branches shall come out of its sides, three branches of candlestick out of one side, and three branches of the candlestick out of the other side. Three cups made like almonds with a bulb and a flower in one branch, and three cups made like almonds and another branch, and with a bulb and a flower. So is the six branches, and they come out of the candlestick, and then the candlestick shall be four bowls made like almonds with their bulbs and flowers, and there shall be a bulb under the two branches of the same piece, and a bulb under the two branches of the same piece, and a bulb under the two branches of the same piece, according to the six branches that proceed out of the candlestick. Their bulbs and their branches shall be made of the same piece. All shall be one piece and work of their gold, and I shall make this the seven lambs, and they shall light its lamps, as they may give light over against it, and its tongs and its ash pans shall be of pure gold, and of its talents of pure gold shall be made with all these vessels, and look that thou make them after their pattern, which was shown thee in the mountain. Moreover, thou shalt make a tabernacle of thin curtains of fine, with blue and blue and purple and scarlet and caravan. Of artistic work shalt thou make them. The length of one curtain shall be twenty eight cubits, and the breadth of one four curtain four cubits, and the curtain shall be all of one measure. The five curtains shall be coupled together one to another, and the other five curtains shall be coupled one to another. And thou shalt make loops of blue upon the edge of the one curtain that is in the edge of the first coupling, and likewise shalt thou make an uppermost edge of the curtain uh, that is utmost in the second coupling. Fifty loops shalt thou make, and the one curtain, and fifty loops shalt thou make, measure the curtain that is in the second coupling. The loops may take hold one of another, and thou shalt make fifty golden clasps, and the couple of the curtains together for the clasps. The, the tabernacle may be one, and thou shalt make curtains of goat's hair to be a covering upon the tabernacle. Eleven, eleven curtains shalt thou make. The length of one curtain shall be. Thirty cubits, and the breadth of one curtain, four cubits, and eleven curtains shall be one of one measure. And thou shalt couple five curtains by themselves, and six curtains by themselves, shalt double the sixth curtain in the front, four front of the tabernacle. And thou shalt make fifty loops on the edge of the one curtain that is outmost in the coupling, and fifty loops on the edge of the curtain in the second coupling. And thou shalt make fifty clasps of grass, and put the clasps into the loops, and couple the thing together, that it may be one, and the remnants of the remains of the curtains of the tent. The half curtain that remains shall hang over the back of the tabernacle, and the cubit on the one side, and the cubit on the other side. That which remains in the length of the curtains on the tent shall hang over the sides of the tabernacle, on the side and on that side to cover it. Thou shalt make a covering for the tent, rams, skins, thy bread, and a covering above of tahash skins.